I'm back again, and this time I thought I would do a video on products that I've really been enjoying um, for a while. I mean, I can't say for the month because I've been using them longer than a month, and I can't say. And uh, you know what? I don't. I don't buy new products every month like that. Um, I mean, I get new stuff, but. I use the same stuff. Yeah, so let's get to it. If I burst into song, that's what I do. Okay, so <laughs> the first product is Max Ambering Rose. Get up in your face. Ambering Rose. I'm using my eyesight cam, so I don't have zoom and autofocus and all that fancy stuff. Here's Ambering Rose. Just know every shade, every shade that I show you is maybe one or two shades deeper than it's appearing. You can't see that. Anyway, it's on my cheeks. I think I look good. Probably can't even see it on my cheeks. Anyways. Apologize for my hair. I'm gonna wash them a little later. Second is Definicils by Lanco. This is the gift with purchase size because my mama bought herself some Lanco perfume. I mean, I knew it when she gave it to me. I was like, You bought perfume, didn't you? She said, You know it. So, yeah, she got perfume. And she gave me the gift with purchase. I thought that was sweet. Okay, and I'll show you. Not a big brush. Um, I would say the Lancome Definicils is a separating mascara. It says say high definition mascara. Okay. Laura Geller's Shadow and Liner Duo in Unearthed. In Dutch chocolate, you get 1.8 grams or 0 0.06 ounces. So, and here you have a light bronzy, a light bronzy shade. I don't even know why I try. And this is a nice chocolatey color. I use this darker color as my liner and I've got it on today and I have this lighter shade here on my lid also wearing that my go with everything I've been using this to blend out my transition color I mix the two shades together and um, the darker shade I use in my crease this is Laura Geller's Biscotti and Toast Sugar free, which means matte. No sparkle. Oh yeah, this this color is slightly deeper than my skin tone, so it works great for blending. And then I mix the two to um, again to blend out the crease. I meant to say this works great in the crease, and then the two together to blend, transition, whatever you call it. And then this lighter shade here, I used to highlight with. So beautiful. There's similar colors in the Urban Decay Naked Palette, so if you have the Naked Palette, you might not need this, but if you find that the colors, I think they're called Buck and Naked. Buck Naked. <laughs> anyway, so if you find that those colors are a little bit too cool, you need something slightly warmer, this is what you're going to need to get. Um, again, I got my in a set. I don't like to pay full price. This is the lip gloss that I wore, I was talking about in the other video. Spark. I've been wearing this lip gloss from Smashbox on top of Max Saint Germain. What I actually do is I apply, um, I apply lavender whip all over my lips. 
I apply Saint Germain, these are matte shades, in the center. And then to make it look like I haven't lost my mind, I put this color on. And I get something that's not scary. Crest eyeliner pencil in it's just brown. Just brown. And then this is the taupe liner. I think it comes in a darker shade. Just the one that was in the kit. Can you see it? Right there. Okay. Did I leave anything out? I've been using Urban Decay Primer Potion. I still don't think it's that great a product. Um, actually, I'm not wearing this right now, but I have been using it. I had it before, and it smelled like medicine, and I got creasing. This one's a little bit oily, and I get creasing. I don't know if it's skin or if I just get you know womp womps. I don't know what it is but I'm not thrilled with this product I prefer the Mary Kay one that I would use and I did not get creasing but um I think the Mary Kay one probably is not as good a value if this works great for you probably stick with this one um cause they gave me more now, and it's still $19. The Mary Kay one is $13. However, you could probably find the Mary Kay one on eBay. Just saying. I'm tired. Thank you for watching. I appreciate that. Stupid.